welcome back to another video. You guys, today I am going to be demonstrating for all of you how I read, write, and reply to comments completely blind on my channel. So many of you guys have been asking me, how do you read our comments? How do you put hearts on them? And I'm going to demonstrate that for you today. So, but before I get into the video, I've already filmed the video, and I just wanna let you guys know, when I went into an app called YT Studio, the app that I managed my channel from, it actually, my husband <laughs> reviewed my footage, and for some reason, the exposure is really bright, so it looks really white. <laughs> I can't, I can't obviously tell, but he says it looks really white, so you won't really see exactly like the words, I guess, right, honey? That's correct. <laughs> so, but you will hear everything I'm doing, um, you know, so you'll kind of get a perspective of what it's like for me because I don't see anything. I don't even see light. So as I am reading and replying to comments and putting hearts on them and emojis, I'm doing it all through my screen reader on my iPhone, my voice over accessibility. So you guys just, just you know, know that. And um, if you guys want to actually see that, my husband has an idea so we can film that where you can actually see it. For some reason, the exposure is just so bright. But um, one other thing I forgot to show you guys on this video you're about to see is my, here I have my iPhone 10. I have a lanyard around my neck. This is how I always wear my phone. It's always right here with me. But I have a screen curtain and uh, so I don't actually, have to, you know, since I don't see the screen, I don't need to see the screen. Well, I can't see the screen. I don't worry about the light. I want to stay battery. So I take three fingers and I do a triple tap. Screen curtain on. And now my screen is darkened. Uh, I can't obviously tell, but it says screen curtains on. So my screen's black. So yeah, it works great. I wanted to show that to you guys in case there's some blind viewers out there who don't know about the screen curtain and you don't need to see the light. So you don't need to see the light. <laughs> anyway, all right, love you guys. Hope you enjoy the video. Okay, you guys, so here we go. I have my iPhone XR here on my coffee table, and I have my other iPhone, my old iPhone 7 on a tripod, which is looking straight down over my iPhone. My husband set this up for me. It was his brilliant idea, yay. I was trying before to film it with one hand and aiming at my camera, uh, aiming at my phone, but I wasn't capturing the entire phone because I was holding it too close. So um, anyway, so this, he says, works. So hopefully all my sighted viewers can see what I am doing here. So I am going to talk a little bit first about my voiceover. So voiceover on Apple devices is a screen reading software. On an Android device, it is called TalkBack. And screen readers um, are also on computers as well. And I just use my iPhone for everything. Literally, I manage my entire YouTube channel, Instagram and Facebook. I do it all just with just this phone right here. It's always on me. I literally wear it around my neck on a lanyard, so I never lose it. It's just always easy access. And yeah, so I film, edit, upload, and reply to all of your comments. And today I'm going to demonstrate for you how I navigate my iPhone and how I reply to your comments because so many of you guys have been asking this and I'm gonna demonstrate this today. Oh my goodness, there's so many little <laughs> details that uh, I've got to remember to just uh, describe to all of you. Um, and I describe for my blind viewers what I'm doing because there's a lot of new new blind blindies out there who are learning how to use their iPhone. And so this is kind of a tutorial as well for them. So hopefully I can give you guys some tips on how to navigate your phone with VoiceOver. Okay, so, oh, and VoiceOver, VoiceOver is free. So yeah, it's built into every Apple device, even my Apple Watch. So... All right, so here we go. I'm going to touch my phone. Many people do not know how oh, to keep, why I cannot in, keep and why teeth. Sorry, I was in an app, uh, in one of my apps. I'm fixing to demonstrate for you guys. So right now I'm on my home screen. Clock, iMovie, YouTube, YT Studio. Okay, so you hear it talking. Uh, before I get into, uh, I guess, the apps and all the finger swipes and stuff, I will talk about uh, the speed, the speed rate of, you know, my speech. So I listen to my phone really fast. It goes up to 100% and I listen to mine at 85 typically. I can understand it at 100, but I like it at 85. But for you guys today in this demonstration, I'm going to slow it down to 55%. So to access my speed, there is an imaginary rotor dial on the front of my, on the, on the screen of my phone. So I take two fingers and I Characters. twist and it will, it rotates between different uh, actions. So that's characters. Words. Words. 
Speaking rate. Here we go, speaking rate. So when I hear it say speaking rate, then I can either swipe up to increase the speed or swipe down to decrease the speed. And let's just slow it down so you can see, or here. <laughs> YouTube, three, edit mode. Oh, hold on. Characters. And every time you, like, you touch something else after you swiped it to speaking rate, you have to redo it again. Words. Speaking rate. Okay, here we go. I'm going to swipe down. 50 per 45, 40 percent, 35, 30, 50, 10 percent, 5 I don't know anyone who would ever listen to it that slow. I literally feel like I'm in slow motion or running through water or running in a dream. You know how that goes. So I speed it up. 10, 50, 40 percent, 45, 50, 55, 60, 70, 75 percent, 80 percent, 85 percent. 90%, 95%, 100%. 100 you guys. Okay, I call this speed listening. Um, and I can understand everything that my phone is speaking at that, at that speed, but I do have to concentrate more. So since I don't really like to always be so, so, so focused, um, and I do kind of like to relax, I will turn it down to 85%. So this is a good speed for me. And you're probably still thinking that is too fast. <laughs> but y'all, people speed read. I speed listen. And over time after, you know, I didn't start out using Apple phone, listening to it at this speed. You know, I probably started out at 60%. But after your brain gets used to it at 60%, then you can increase it. It's like your brain is learning a language and learning how to interpret. And it's kind of like I think of like when my girls were babies and, um, you know, like even any parent, right? <laughs> You're like the only one who can understand your baby as your toddler is talking. Um, you have to translate for everyone. You get used to it and you learn, right? So same thing with this. Okay, so let's... Um, Characters, words, speaking rate. 80%, 75%, 70%, 65%, 65 55%. We're going to keep it at 55% today for the demonstration because I think most people can and will be able to understand everything uh, that I'm doing today. So, okay, um, let's get into one of my favorite apps, you guys. So, uh, to access my apps or with voiceover, you with normal phones, right, with normal sighted people using your iPhones or you know, Android, if you touch an app, YouTube, it three new items. automatically opens it. But since we need to hear what button we're touching, it does not open it. It only opens the app when you double tap on the app. So I, muscle memory, I know like where certain apps are on my screen. So I know, or roughly, so I know like, you know, like I said, I just touched YouTube. It's in this top right area of my phone. YouTube. Three yep, <laughs> got it. Facebook's a little bit higher to the right. Facebook. There you go. Items. I did not see you guys. I do not have sight at all. And I typically, well, I always use my screen curtain on my phone, which blacks out my screen because it saves my battery. So I don't even, yeah, I don't see light. So it doesn't, doesn't make a difference to me. Okay, so I can uh, just, you know, touch the screen or I can swipe. Instagram, now clock, oh, Five, see. Instagram. 17 new items. So, like, it, my phone gives me notifications out loud. So, normally, when sighted people on their phones get the little bar, the little banner with a notification at the top, my phone with voiceover reads it out loud to me. Just, yeah, so it's great. So, okay, so I'm going to touch at the top left area of my phone. Clock, 520, iMovie. And I'm going to swipe my finger to the right. YouTube, three new IT messages. Uh -huh. Now, maybe, a notification, uh -huh. more, dismiss. I'm dismissing that text messages. message. So yeah, it literally reads messages. every notification, text message, everything. So okay, so I'm gonna to swipe to the right. Seeing a Ira, be my eyes, a poly blind squid, utility poem, safari, be spec, faced, evite, page two of five. Okay, so I adjustable. swipe right to go down my apps on my home screen or I swipe left to go up. Evite, faced, be spec, saf, poem, ut, blinds, a poly, be my eye, Ira, see, why, ut, iMovie, clock. 5.22 p.m. Okay, so um, we're going to go to YT Studio, YT Studio, which is here on the right side, and I'm going to double tap and open up this app. YT Studio, dislike the M-Arms and T, M-Arms and T, okay. button, 
You guys, so um, here we go. We are, I'm gonna go back out of this. This is in the comments section, but I'm gonna show you this. Most re open navigation. Open button. navigation is in the top left corner. I know that the button's up there. I'm gonna double tap on that. And it takes Close me menu. basically. Button. Playlists, button, videos, button, dashboard, button. It takes me to the, the home screen of this app. Uh, which has a couple of like a few different buttons here where I manage my channel. This app, YT Studio, is an excellent app for any YouTube creators out there. It keeps track of all my comments across my entire channel in order. So if someone's commenting right now, um, it will give me that comment first. Um, and it doesn't matter if they're commenting on my newest video or my oldest video, they're in order. Um, yeah, so it's really great. The normal YouTube, just the YouTube app where you get your notifications, it does not give me every single comment that is coming in across my channel, which I don't understand why, but it doesn't. Um, so this app is really, really good. And I can watch, I can, uh, I can go to videos. Analytics, comments, analytics, videos, dashboard. You can button. look at your subscriber count I know on YouTube now they don't give exact subscriber count for bigger channels, so, but on this app it will give you your exact, you know, exact number of how many subscribers you have um, and your analy analytics. So let's go down to videos. videos. So I just swiped to the right and it went down to the next button. So I can click on here and I can see all my videos and all the statistics, anal you know, analytics from each video. Playlists. Button. Same thing with playlists. Comments. Button. And now this is where I go into comments to read all of your comments. So I double tap on comments. Open navigation. Button. And then I touch at the top of my screen. Why I cannot keep Antonia's harness after retirement. Button. So this is um, the newest comment right here. And it just reads the name of the video that someone's commenting on. Antonia Henriksen, one minute ago. I never come across people who have the same name as me so naturally when I saw the video title I for very selfish reasons had to click on it. Aww. Now I feel like karma slapped me in the face since sadly dog Antonia died and all the comments keep saying <laughs> R.I.P. Antonia. By the way her nickname Tony is so much better than my auntie. From here on all friends and family may call me Tony. Aww. That dog Antonia really is resting in peace. I didn't Aww. know her but I feel like we were kindred spirits. Oh, that is so sweet. I love the name Antonia. Oh, that is so sweet. I know my first Anto my first guiding angel, Antonia, is in heaven, and I know she's guiding me from there and watching over mommy every day. So that is so sweet. So I listened to that. Now I'm going to swipe to the right. Antonia Henrik, read more. Like this comment along with zero I can other people. Double button. tap on that like button to like it. Dislike this comment. Button. If I wanted to dislike a comment, I can double tap on dislike, which I do not usually ever dislike a comment. It takes a whole lot for me to dislike a comment. Typically, if I get a really hateful, you know, ugly comment, I just keep going. I just keep moving on. I just, you know, look, look past it and don't let it get to me. But sometimes I'm like, oh, I just want to say something to them. So I do. So occasionally, but in a nice way. <laughs> reply. Button. Okay. So the reply button, I could double tap that to reply. Hard button. And there's the heart button. Everyone's like, how does she put hearts on all our comments? So I double tap on the heart. Selected. Re comment loved comment loved and that cool and so if i want to reply which i will reply i'm going to button. double tap on reply text field is editing okay insertion point at start insertion point at start so here on the bottom right corner of my phone dictate return dictate button here's the keyboard i have the dictate button which i think to you know, sighted viewers, sighted people, it looks like a microphone button. I don't know what it looks like. All I know is what it sounds like, and it's the dictate button. So I'm going to double tap that, and you'll hear a ding. And then I know then I can speak. And then I will take two fingers, double tap on the screen when I'm finished speaking, and then it will insert my text. So, and then I have to sometimes edit my text because Siri is not always accurate. You know, or sometimes I want to add things myself. So, okay, let's see here. Oh my goodness, comma! I absolutely love your name, exclamation point. Thank you so much for commenting, comma. Yes, comma. My baby girl was so precious and the most incredible guiding angel, exclamation point. Thank you for your sweet words, comma. Smiley face blessings. Inserted, oh my goodness, I absolutely love your name. 
Thank you so much for commenting. Yes, my baby girl was so precious and the most incredible guiding angel. Thank you for your sweet words. Smiley blessings. Okay, so she got it all right. Yay. But if I wanted to go through my text, right? If I wanted to edit through the text, uh, you know, so let's just say, let's say, oh, let's do this. We'll add an emoji. We'll take away the smiley face. The smiley is easy, right? So sometimes I don't have time to go into the emoji categories and select one. It can be really time consuming, but I do. I definitely do those, um, and I'll show you how I'll do that. But so it's just easier sometimes just to say smiley, right? So I'm going to delete, delete the smiley. So I, t I have my keyboard, my, uh, my keyboard set up with my touch typing. Um, so when I hit Return. delete, delete S. Okay. Return. Oh no. Why did it take with us? W. Let's put S. Okay. So I Sierra. Sierra. S. S G. Words. Oh, oh, that's right. I, had, I said many blessings. I forgot what I said at the end. Okay. Many blessings. Okay. So let's swipe past the many, but we're going to swipe from the end of the text, um, towards the front. So I'm going to, uh, take my finger. I have to think about every step I'm doing here. Okay, so I take my finger and I'm gonna swipe up. So I'm moving the cursor from the right side to the left. N I S. And it's moving Sierra. it character at a time, but it's faster actually if I go word at a time. Uh, so then I take my two fingers and I twist them on the screen. Words. And it just switched to words, right? So now when I swipe up, instead of going character by character, it's gonna go word by word. Bless. Miss Beth, smiley, smile, blessings, blessings, smiley. Okay, blessings, smiley, and I'll just go to the left a little bit more just to let you guys hear. Words, comma, sweet, your, for, you, thank, angel, guided, incorrect, mo, the, and, fresh, so, was, girl, girl, All right, was. so now I'm going to go back to the right, so it's going to read the words to the right. So, precious, and, the, most, incorrect, guided, angel, thank, you, for, your, sweet, words, comma, smiley. All right, so now we're on the smiley. So now I'm going to delete the smiley. Delete. So I put my finger on the delete button, and I'm just going to let up. Right parent. Delete. Hyphen. Delete. Re colon. Okay, so it just took out the smiley. So I'm going to insert in that little spot, I'm going to insert a heart. So I'm going to go to my emojis. Numbers. Emoji. Button. Which is the emoji button is in on the bottom left corner. So you just heard it say emoji. Emoji. Button. So I'm going to double tap that. Next keyboard. English U.S. So now if I touch the screen. Frequently used. Grinning face with squinting eyes and sweat drop. 13. <laughs> face with tears of joy. Set. Red heart. 2. Purple heart. Blue heart. Face blowing a kiss. Winking face. I'm just Ten. moving my finger around the screen so you can hear the different emojis. Hold on. First quarter moon with face. Koala face. Handbag. Sunfla sunflower. Smileys and people. Grinning face with normal eyes. Face with tears of joy. Slightly smiling face. Upside down face. 43. Face rolling on the floor laughing. Grinning face with squinting eyes. Frequently used. This is how I Open actually... Eyes. 28. This is how I see emojis. It's through Cucumber. descriptions. Wolf head. Laughing with tears cat face. 19. <laughs> Slightly smiling face. Four. Grinning face. Okay. Blue heart. Blue Four. heart. Four. I'm Purple heart. I'm going to use Three. a yellow heart. Red heart. Two. Yellow heart. One. My colored hearts mean different things. So I use yellow hearts for like a friendly, um, you know, like a friendly, sweet love right so yellow heart so i touched the yellow heart and when i let off with my finger it inserted it in place so i'm going to next keyboard english us button. double tap where the emoji button was emoji now it took it back to keyboard again oh my goodness i absolutely love your name capital t hold on send text field is editing here we go oh my goodness she's reading it back i absolutely love your name thank you so much for commenting yes my baby girl was so precious and the most incredible guiding angel. Thank you for your sweet words. Yellow heart. Blessings. Word okay. mode. Insertion point between yellow heart and blessings. So it told the where the insertion point. Position. So it told me where the uh, cursor is. Okay. So anyway, I'm done with that. So now I'm going to send. Dismiss. Joy Ross. Text feed. Send comment. Button. Double tap on send. Send comment. There you go. Added. And you guys, Open I know this is taking button. a lot. Like this is taking a lot of time right now. And I usually do this super, super fast. Published, open, your most recent, Joy Ross, one set, how I use my iPhone completely blind but, to detect light. Yeah, but yeah, but it's just me. It's, it goes by so fast and I'm really efficient and quick, but I'm taking time for all of you today. Just like this reply, okay, read more. Joy Ross, one, how I use my iPhone completely blind to detect light. The seeing AI app. This button. is a different comment. Marks T, 28 minutes ago. Here's their... How do you know how to record in that or in her living room if you're blind? 
<laughs> how do I know if uh, I'm how do how do I know to record and if I'm in my living room if I'm blind? Well, okay. Ah, uh, so many. Uh, how do I answer all these things? Uh, so it, sometimes I'm just like, is it worth answering? Sometimes I give a simple answer depending on you know what's going on and. Uh, or sometimes I refer people back to a different video, so I'll post a link to a certain video that answers it in more, you know, depth for people. So let's just see. Okay. MR, like, disk, reply button. Uh, you know, I'm going to skip past that one right now. Let's just keep going. I want to get through some more comments, but I can come back to that one. But it's easy. I, I'll just tell you guys. I know that I'm in my living room. Just because I'm blind doesn't mean that I'm not aware of my space and where I'm at. You know, you don't have to see to understand when you're in your kitchen, right? Uh, tactily, sounds, you, you understand, you know, where you are. Your bedroom, you know, like you just know by touch. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Hard. Action menu. Many people do not know. IVX Mitchell X. 47 minutes oh, ago. Many people okay, do not yeah. IVX Mitchell X. 47 minutes ago. Just on that back wall. Yet and troughs the walk into a maze where you have to turn corners to find the elevator hidden in a corner. <laughs> yeah, that was on this video of me and Macy's with Antonia, my first guide dog, and the elevator was hidden in this back corridor area and... The lady had said it was on the back wall, but it was a little bit more hidden than just the back wall. But anyway, so I'm going to keep IVX going. Like, dip, rip, pop, act, James KP, 50 minutes ago. Like she's blind and it's obviously bad, but this woman was really rude and pretentious. <laughs> oh my gosh, this person thinks I'm being rude. I wasn't. I don't know. I It's so crazy. This video that I was just referring to, the Macy's video, so many people, it's like bipolar, like with like comments. Someone will say, I sound like the kindest, sweetest person and, you know, a Disney princess. And then some people will call me horrible names. And that is just not me. It was not the situation. I don't understand why people say really mean things about me. I was stressed. It was a very stressful messages, not oh. notification, dismiss. Dismissed. But yes, ago, anyway, but you know what? Know how to record and enter in her living room if her Kurt Daniels people go to detail you know, are entitled to, you know, their opinions. So, I just try to keep you know, telling myself that their their opinions don't, you know, you know, they don't really mean those negative comments, you know, the negative opinions aren't truly a reflection, of course, of who I am. So I just let a lot of things go. I think if you're wanting to see the negativity in certain things, you're going to find it, right? And if you're looking for the positivity and the joy, you're going to see that. So it just depends on what kind of person you are, right? Why I cannot keep Antonia's harness after retirement. Button. Okay. Kurt Danielson, 55 minutes ago. Where is the blind person? <laughs> what? Where is the blind person? I'm guessing they're not sure in this video who's blind. You know, I guess that's a compliment that I don't look blind. Um, I've heard that so much, but I'm going to reply to that one because I think it's fun sometimes to reply to these these silly comments. I'm like, um, that would be me. Kurt, like, dis reply, but text field, it return, dictate, button. That would be me, smiley face. I'm completely blind and see no light perception, smiley face. <laughs> Inserted that would be me, smiley. I am completely blind and see no light perception, smiley. <laughs> send comment, dismiss, dismiss, create comment, dismiss, create, join text, send comment. There you go. Send comment. Okay. Reply so I'm going to scroll down a little navigation. further, you guys. So I'm going to take, so if you want to know how to scroll, for any of my blind viewers who are out there wanting to know how to do this, you take three fingers, push them on your, touch your screen, and then you're going to push upwards and you're going to hear a little squeaky sound and it'll tell you what page you're on so listen here reply page three of six you heard the squeak and it said page three of six page four of six page 10 of 12 page six of 11 and if i want to go back up same thing i put three fingers on the screen and instead of pushing up i pull down page five of 11 page four of 11 page three of 11 page two of 11 like that so that's how i do that Page three of eleven. Okay, so let's then I just touch anywhere on the screen. Why I cannot keep Antonia's read more, but like this con. Many people do not know Lil Ford. One hour ago edited. Imagine some dick guides her to the wrong spot. Edit. Or if people got really quiet while she is talking and just walk away so she wouldn't know they left. 
<laughs> and that happens all the time. So many people uh, will be talking to me, whether it's you know one on one or in a group, and it could be really noisy, um, or yeah, and then they just you know get up for whatever reason, have to run away for a second. You know, even my own family's done this. You know, and it's no one does it on purpose. They don't always know. You know, they don't think about it, and not all the time. Um, and they'll get up and walk the right way, and I will just be standing there, sitting there at the table, or yeah, in this room, and I'm talking to myself. Or if I'm talking to my husband, and my kids run away, and I'm like, I turn to my kids to talk to them, and then my husband will say, uh, they they're not there anymore. <laughs> they walked off, and I'm like, ah, oh, darn it. But it's it's. it's so embarrassing. I don't really get embarrassed. It's just funny at this point, but I just sit there, especially when you're by yourself and you're just like, well, I am talking to my imaginary friend. Good times. Yes. I just, you know, think maybe people just assume I have a earbud and I'm on the phone, right? <laughs> so, um, okay. But that's, you guys, how I, I do it, you know? Dislike, reply. It's SCR 7 Z Mix 5 KCV 6 F3, two hours ago, two. 32 stethoscope D. Okay, uh, hold on. D I hard. heard that one a while ago. Action menu. Joy talks about dating life. Ooh. First kiss and the blind date which led to marriage. That was a good video. If you guys haven't seen that one, I'll talk about my blind date on my with my husband. I met him on a blind date. Ba -dum -ba -dum. Anyway, it was surely a blind date. We were set up and it was a match made in heaven. We fell in love at first touch. Ha ha. <laughs> anyway, let's see. Justin a Young, two hours ago. Absolutely, I'm so encouraged by your faith. One reply. Aww. So, and I replied to her. That was really sweet. Um, so, that is how I comment to you guys on YouTube. At least through YT, YT Studio. I'll go out of that real quick. YT, YT Studio. And I'm going to go into YouTube. YouTube. Three new items. So, if I want to check some just notifications YouTube. in YouTube, yeah. I... Selected. Lo selected. Selected. Inbox. Tag. My inbox Selection. on the bottom of my app. More notification. More notification. Young Namakala commented, why not make a video totally black and make us wonder what the heck is happening? <laughs> Two hours ago. Oh. Why not make a video completely black and make us wonder what the heck is happening? Right. So I have definitely have thought about doing that. Uh, let me know if you guys would be interested in a video like that. So go on adventures, but the screen is black. And then you you kind of get to see it through um, kind of through my eyes, even though I, I'm blind, I don't see complete black. I mean, even though I'm, yeah, I don't see light. I'm not in complete darkness. Does that mean, no, it, it probably doesn't make sense, but ugh, so hard to explain, but yeah, so I might do that. Let me know if you guys are interested in that. Okay. So here I'm going to, so I'm in notifications. EOO replied. commented. More notifications. So I'm going to go to my Edit. channel. Sachi rape. Erasmo. Latest comments. Oh, here's Erasmo it. commented. The video at the mall gave me anxiety. This video took away my anxiety. Okay. Later mentions selected your account. Double button. tap on that. Paid get you get you to time watch your channel. My button. double tap on this my channel, and now we're here yeah. on my channel. Button. Joy Ross, 145k subscribers. Still sounds so crazy to think that I have that many of you guys watching my channel. It's amazing. I love all of you so so much. Thank you for taking the time to even just sit here today and you know, listen to me, watch me, whatever, um, go through, you know, this demonstration. It just means so much to me that have your love and support. Crazy. So amazing. Okay. So here's my channel. Guide dog Arabella does not love airplane landings. Watch till the end. 10 K views. What took my eyes out and put them on a mannequin head. Blindfold gift exchange. 11 K views. One week ago. So I'm just swiping minutes, down my channel. If I wanted Button. to go into this video, I could um, navigating blindly to a public restroom in a shopping mall with my guide dog. So I can so challenging 6.8 K views. A double tap. Video player heading share download but save to playlist. Joy Ross but subscribes to this channel. Up next autoplay navigating blindly with my guide dog. Okay, so I'm going to take two fingers and that will stop the video. So I'm going to listen for the Christmas tree. Hold on. Okay, here we go. A big surprise for so Kirby. I'm going to swipe to the, show. I'm going to scroll to the bottom. This is the Bullet. comments. One week ago edited. This is the first time I've ever commented on a YouTube video. I just wanted to say you are truly amazing, Joy. Aww. I couldn't help but to let you know. I appreciate how motivated and determined you are. Watching your videos has taught me so much. You strive every day to achieve an optimal quality of life despite living with a disability. I appreciate how you never let blindness stop you from living the life you deserve. No one is immune to experiencing difficulties in their lives, mm -mm. whether it be an illness, loss of a loved one, or any challenge faced with. 
but you showed us how important being resilient is. Thank you for that. Mm -hmm. I hope the Ross family had a wonderful Christmas, and I wish you a happy new year. I'm looking forward to more great content in 2020. Grinning face with tightly closed eyes. Read oh, more. Six I, likes. One reply. I Few love reply. that. It's so sweet. So sweet. So anyway, I so I can go through my comments. Max. Inca, oh. Billy Joe Ross. Billy Joe Ross. Accept. Hold on. Decline. Button, accept. Message. Decline. <laughs> this is declining my daddy. <laughs> I'll call you back, YouTube. daddy. Video player. Um, Heading. So anyway, so that's that. You know, that's another way I can read comments. And video play, collapse I'm going to collapse the video. So I double tap when it said, where it said collapse. Public blind, na, to, guide, uh, about, channels, story, community, so there's a community four, tab, seven, and button. this is another area where I have comments. So I write post. I'm double tap on community. Back, I wrote a post here yesterday. Joy Ross, one day ago. Joy, Joy Ross, one day ago. Inquiring your thoughts? This could be for any of you. I know many of you have so many questions for me whether you yourself are blind or sighted, but would really love to know my visually impaired and blind friends' thoughts as this video idea pertains to our life. And so community. I wrote this and I double tap, when I double tap I on this, to create a and button. it opens this post I wrote, and now I'm going to scroll to the bottom. Joy Ross, page, comments, 41. Eileen Hansen, one day ago edited, how do you think your faith has impacted your journey with vision loss? Are you glad that you had partial sight and fully lost your vision later in life? Or would you rather have had no vision completely at birth? If you had the option to have your vision completely restored, star right now, star, would you? Or would you choose to remain blind? Eight likes. Hmm. Are y'all want to hear my answer? Joy Ross. Already broke verified this. user. One day ago, Eileen Hansen, my faith has everything to do with my joyful attitude, perspective, and vision. I never say I lost my vision because through my complete loss of eyesight, God has restored a different kind of vision into my life. And I have actually done a video on this topic a couple years ago. Talking about if I was offered my eyesight back, would I choose it? My answer I talked about in the video is a firm no. I don't feel blind even though my eyes cannot see. In fact, when I was weighing out the pros and cons to my blindness, guess what? The pros to being blind far outweigh the cons. How amazing is that? I see so much through my other senses, but more importantly through the eyes of my heart. Mm -hmm. Yes, of course it's more challenging being completely blind, but look at all the beautiful blessings I have in my life because of it. I would never have this YouTube channel if I had not lost my eyesight, nor would I be having this beautiful impact on this world that to me is more important and is worth every challenge i face yellow heart 15 likes you guys that is so so true i am truly blessed to have this beautiful life and i wouldn't change it for anything in the world because if it were not for what i've gone through and all the challenges that i even continue to face daily i wouldn't have the the heart the compassion the insight you know, to be able to impart to all of you. I, I think sometimes we have to go through challenges in our life to truly appreciate what matters most. And it shapes and molds us and it changes us to be able to understand pain and understand what other people are going through to help relate. And I believe we're not here on this earth just to you know, just to live for ourselves. I believe we're here to live beyond ourselves and to live beyond even our own challenges and to reach out and to make a difference in lives. And that's what life is all about. It's, even through your own pain, you can help change someone else's life. And at the same time, when you do that, like I do through my videos, like in return, it feeds you, it heals you, it gives you encouragement, encouragement and strength to keep moving forward through your own challenges. So you guys, you know, that is just my heart and I am so grateful that you're a part of my journey with me and you know, I just hope and pray every day that my videos are inspiring you like I've already heard through so many comments and I continue to hear in your comments and um, that's, that's what makes me so happy and gives me joy in my challenges and my, my you know, difficult moments and I'm grateful for you and I love you so much. You're more than a number, you're more than a view even though I love that, I'm increasing and growing, but f growth for me doesn't mean like it's not, you know, for fame or fortune or, you know, just people, you know, saying I'm amazing. I just enjoy the growth because I know the more people that are watching, the more people that are subscribing, that means the more lives that I can, I can reach and I can inspire and I can give hope and spread joy too, you know? So that's, the beauty of you know of life and I want people to know my name because if they know my name hopefully then they'll know my story and if they know my story then they'll find hope for tomorrow right
Thanks again, you guys. Keep commenting. Um, let me know if there's any questions you have, you know, anything I've showed you today. And uh, if you have any other ideas for videos you would like to see in the future, the best, you guys, is yet to come. So I'm excited for 2020, right? The best is yet to come. All right, love you guys. Always remember, joy is a choice. All right, mwah.